Hey YouTubers, friends, subscribers. So Coughlin finally made his uh, Cult of Dusty, where he says he destroys the Cult of Dusty. No, wait a minute, hang on. Watch out everybody. It's the Coughlin fail bird flying by. So this is um, where Coughlin claims to destroy the Cult of Dusty. He, he throws around the usual shitty thing that uh, Cult of Dust is actually racist in his video where he, he calls uh, black religious people Uncle Tom's and uh, betraying their race. I, I think the, I don't think the video was racist at all. I think Cult of Dust is just pointing out the fact that um, bl black people are actually endorsing a book and and they're actually indoctrinating their children into a book that actually held them in slavery for over 200 years. And I can see his point in that. You know, it is kind of fucking idiotic. Is it really? But that's not what Coughlin's video was about. I've seen this, uh, this, uh, this video uh, brewing for a few weeks now because Coughlin's got quite a bee in his bonnet about um, the Court of Dusty calling himself a comedian and Coughlin thinks that uh, you can only be called a comedian if you perform on stage or you, you've gone around the country and you, you've done uh, comedy festivals and stuff like that well I remember when I first came on YouTube that um, on the uh, actual options on your channel in the uh, edit section there was actually a list and you, you could actually choose from I think it was a uh, reporter um, editor or whatever uh, there was guru and there was the option of comedian now you could give these titles to yourself to demonstrate this is how uh, it's what your channel was going to represent and I, do, I just want to know Coughlin because you, you like to ask people questions I want to ask you a question who exactly came up to you and crowned you a comedian who came up to you and gave you a certificate that says here you are you're now a comedian. And I think this was brought up on your video comments. The fact that, um, that people can uh, tell jokes in their, in their videos or they can uh, be funny in their videos and be comedians but not be professional comedians. Uh, this is the point that was brought up in your comment section. Like um, you, you get people on YouTube that play the guitar, they sing songs, and they can be called musicians, but they're not rock stars or anything like that. And I think that's the difference. You know, you, you can't you can't claim the title for yourself. You, you can't you can't point to anybody else and say you're not a comedian because humour is a very personal thing. Things that somebody else might find funny, somebody else won't. Somebody might find the Court of Dusty hilarious, somebody else won't. Somebody might watch one of your videos, find you hilarious, somebody else won't. It's a very personal thing, humour and comedy. Which is why there's a wide variety of comedy in the world, because each individual aspect of comedy appeals to somebody else. So merely stating that, oh, they can't be comedians because they haven't been on stage, they haven't been around the country doing comedy festivals, is a bullshit argument. It really is. And your whole video, The Court of Dusty, was really a weak one. You know, this this is all about you getting butt hurt because um, you're not quite as popular as the Court of Dusty, uh, really. <laughs> Are you Coughlin? You know what, really? You, you know, instead of actually um, going around pointing the finger at people and saying you're not a comedian. You're not a comedian. I'm a comedian. Maybe you need to uh, take a look in the mirror, Coughlin, because how long have you been doing this now? How long have you been doing this for? 10, 11 years? And you have to make videos on YouTube begging people to come to your shows. You find it hard to get bums on seats. At your comedy shows. So maybe that should be telling you something that maybe you're not quite cut out for the comedy circuit. 
maybe you're just not that good enough to be a professional comedian. Maybe you're okay to be a, a mediocre comedian on uh, YouTube, and maybe that's where your fame lies, you know, YouTube, and that's it. Maybe that's all you'll ever be, or maybe it's time just to hang up the, the comedy the comedy suit and say, yeah, I tried it, I failed, time to move on. Because when you have to, when you have to make begging videos like you made, it is kind of pathetic, and uh, I think this is where the whole Cult of Dusty video came from. It's your own frustration, and I think you realise deep down that you're never going to make it as a comedian, really, because your humour is a very narrow, narrow band sort of humour that only appeals to a handful of people and I think that Mad Zhangyi said it the best, you know, you're just a guy that goes on stage and just whines and complains about how the world is. There isn't really much comedy or humour that you basically, you're doing a live YouTube video like you do on YouTube and I found this quite funny too, really, that you were saying that, oh these are just guys that, that just make a video and they just shout and whine and stuff. Well, I remember you in the early days Coughlin and right up to the present day, that's basically all you do. You just shout and swear, and you make vulgar comments in your video, and somehow we're supposed to take that as comedy. And I believe somebody else said within your comment section, you know, where's your comedy material in your videos? Because there isn't any, really, is there? So, maybe you should take a good look at yourself before you go around accusing others of not being comedians. And I think it's just you projecting your own failure onto other people. This is a spot mindset sign up. May God be less. <coughs> <coughs>